Hello, eighth graders. Welcome from the front porch of Mr. Lewis's house. It is finally some nice weather coming our way. Hey, I wanted to just talk with you guys quickly about a couple of things. I'm sending out um, an email to you guys on Skyward that's going to have some information regarding marching band. There's going to be a letter and there's also a video um, talking to you about marching band and then there'll be this video. So I, I basically wanted to talk with you guys. I know in eighth grade, a lot of people are on the fence whether they should do band in high school or not. It's always a time to make a decision. Um, and what I can tell you from my point of view, almost all the kids that wind up going on in the high school band enjoy high school band far more than they do band at Kramer. And there's a number of reasons they do. Number one, um, you do a lot more performances. Okay, there's no practice cars, which is nice. So that's another issue. But also the big thing is you go from a group of 30 or 40 kids that are all your classmates to a group of over 100 kids of four different grades. And so you meet all kinds of people. It's a real rush to play in a band that big. And, and, and it's just a really cool experience. So I feel like, in my opinion, high school band is a big payoff for all the time you've been putting in the last three years in junior high band. So I would encourage you to at least try it. If there's 10 kids on the fence and we talk 10 kids into trying band their freshman year, eight of them wind up stay, sticking it out for the rest of the time. That's how much they like it. All right, it's a lot different. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of cool things and a lot of opportunities you have in high school band that you would not have in junior high band. So I would really encourage you guys, and I, I've already talked to a couple kids, you need a fine arts credit to graduate from high school. So even if you wind up taking band your freshman year and you decide it's not, you don't have an interest in it and you don't want to continue to do it, it's not like you wasted that credit your freshman year. You now have your fine arts credit out of the way. All right, so again, I wish this wasn't the way we were in. In a normal year, we'd talk to you about marching band. We'd have the kids come over. We'd have already been working on the music for two or three weeks by now. And you guys would kind of start to see what marching band's all about. Um, but we just don't have that opportunity, obviously. So I'm gonna really encourage you guys, if you're afraid it's gonna be too hard or it's gonna take up too much time, if that is not the case at all, we help you out each step of the way. Um, we have upperclassmen and myself and Mr. Orange being the drum majors. We all work with you. So as long as you're willing to show up and work hard, you will be successful. All right, a couple other things I wanted to mention to you. Um, I'm not doing any new assignments this coming week. Uh, all I'm gonna do, I put on that song. So if you can check out that song, I'll have some um, information that I'll send out Sunday about that song, trying to record that song. But in terms of, I'm not gonna put any new assignments on for next week, all right? Have a great Memorial Day weekend. Please look over the letter and the video regarding uh, marching band, and we will talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.